<laughs> As it seems I have no other options, I have conceded to reveal some important information to you, Crystal Gems. This Whoa. is the Earth. At the very center of the planet's core lies the cluster. Rotate. This is the cluster, a massive artificial fusion composed of millions of gem shards. It has laid dormant for thousands of years within this planet's crust. When this gem activates and takes its form, the result will be catastrophic. Now! What is that? It's the cluster. It does not look like that. But it is real, and it can activate at any moment! Wow! What a cluster. That abomination must be stopped. But how? We'll need to build some sort of machine to take us to the center of the Earth. It'll have to- Hey! I wasn't finished speaking. What we need is to build some sort of machine to take us to the center of the Earth. It'll need to withstand up to 360 gigapascals of pressure and temperatures of 9,800 degrees. Well, we mustn't waste time. We need to start finding parts for this machine immediately. Yes, obviously. We'll start by dismantling all devices inside this dwelling. What? Uh, this primitive radiation concentrator should come in handy. Yeah. This primitive vibration transmitter could possibly serve a function. There's a remote chance something useful could be inside this primitive image cube. Wait! I have a better idea that doesn't involve destroying the house. Classic Steven. All right. What we have here in the barn should be adequate enough for us to get started. First, I recommend we organize the component types and assemble a rough blueprint based on what we have available. <laughs> Sorry, Steven. It's a lovely drawing, but it won't look like this. Hmm. Good. Yes, this is adequate. Thank you. You can go now. Uh, what? Hmm? Um, that will be all. How do you get her to leave? Excuse me, I am not leaving. Yeah, she's got to stay and help build the drill thing, right? <laughs> no, no, <laughs> you're confused. A pearl can't build a thing like this. Why not? Because pearls aren't for this. They're for standing around and, and looking nice and, and uh, holding your stuff for you, right? That's enough. If we're going to work together, you're going to have to listen to me. Listen to you? <laughs> Did you teach her to talk like this? What are you talking about? She's a pearl. She's a made-to-order servant, just like the hundreds of other pearls being flaunted around back on Homeworld. Wait, there's hundreds of pearls? Well, yes, but... And she looks like a fancy one, too. Oh, hundreds of pearls. So, who do you belong to anyway? Nobody! Then what are you for? Well, you can belong to me for now. <laughs> a peridot with a pearl. <laughs> what would they say back home? Now listen here, you tiny twerp. In case you've forgotten, you're on our turf now. And I didn't fight a thousand-year war for this planet's independence to take orders from the likes of you! Excuse me? I am a natural technician and a certified kindergartner. I was made for this. You were made to take orders, not to give them. Whoa, whoa, hang on, guys. Now we can all agree that you're both good at building things. So can't you just try listening to each other? No! I'm as good at building things as you. Better, even. Ha! Name one thing you could engineer better. Go on. Robots. Hmm? You should build robots. Giant robots. I see a race. A giant robo race with prizes. We are the, the crystal, crystal gems. gems. We'll all 